We've been harnessing the wind since the ancient Egyptians used sailboats to travel, and windmills were used in agriculture in China over 2,000 years ago. Americans were using wind turbines to produce electricity as early as the 1800s. You may have seen fields of turbines in wide open spaces where you live, since more than three quarters of U.S. states produce wind energy on a large scale. They may look small from a distance, but a modern turbine can be as tall as a 20-story building with airplane wing-shaped blades that are as long as a football field. The blades spin at a slow speed of about one revolution every three seconds. A computer inside the box that sits at the top of the tower controls the direction of the blades to make sure they capture the most wind possible. The blades are connected to faster spinning gears inside the box that create kinetic energy. A generator converts that energy into electricity, which travels down the tower through a cable. The cable connects to the power grid that serves our communities. See? All it takes is a little fresh air to make the turbines go round. <laughs>